Hi, I'm Doug Wallman. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing video of this nebulizing diffuser. I just got it from uh, Aromis. Uh, I think a closer pronunciation would be Aromis. It's their refurbished. I saved thirty dollars that way, so it's fifty nine ninety nine. It's the model called, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, Solum Lux Eros. Solum Lux Eros. I'm going to guess that's pretty close. And I noticed they had some different timer options as far as how long the pump is uh, remaining on. Most of them are on 10 minutes on, 10 minutes off. But in addition to that, there's no when will it turn off. Uh, then you have to turn it back on. That, that function is set to, by default, four hours. But they have other options. It could be one hour. It could be four hours, which is what I got. No, no, sorry. That's the default. Eight hours is what I got. And then there's a 12-hour um, continuous operation on that one, which means it doesn't turn on and off, every, you know, 10 minutes cycling. Uh, I'm going to say pause, 10 minutes on, 10 minutes off. Uh, so I got the eight hours. That way maybe it can make it through the night, but yet not be running continuously. So I thought that was a good option. So, yep, I got the eight hour, but yet it's 10 minutes on and off. Or you could cause, you could call it pausing, although I've never heard anyone else refer, it, refer to it as such. But with that, I will get to unboxing. And I was wondering if we needed a different angle with the camera. I was wondering if we needed a different angle with the camera, but I think this will do right here. Okay, so we will zoom in just a little bit. Zoomed in a little better there. I think we're ready to unbox this. <laughs> yeah. Now with this, I did order some essential oils. I think I got the lemon, but we can look at that later. We're really here for the, we're really here for the diffuser. So here's the box it comes in. So it looks like it comes with a quick start video. You just have to go to that link. And looks like it's www.aromas.co forward slash start. There we go. All right. Here's the owner's manual. Nebulizing Aromatherapy Diffuser Owner's Manual. Aromas Aromatherapy. Attach bottle, connect to power, add oil, place cap on top. And then it talks about the timer and a circle date. Someone specifically circle date on this, but anyhow, we're not going to worry too much about it right now. But that's basic. Basically how the owner's manual looks. I'm not going to get too detailed into that. What? Besides the foam that was here, that's what this looks like. When you open it. <laughs> oh, my props are sort of in my own way. There we go. So this particular model, um, well, I don't know, if, I can't remember for sure if the model is still allowing for two different finishes or if this is exactly that model 
because it has this particular finish or almost unfinished look but no it's it's i think it's got a little polish on it i don't know much about woodwork so i better stop talking but it's, to me it's like a tan uh sort of finish so it's kind of cool and there's the top Of for a video, we like to get this untaped rather quickly, right? Or fast forward, which I don't do so much. <laughs> I can, but. So there's your top. Pretty cool, huh? Lost your glass reservoir, not really your top. The power supply in this little box. So that's all that's in there. Well, I didn't mention the pipette. There's that too. Yay! I better look one more time, make sure I didn't miss anything. Read wall. There goes my mic. Um, I'll just read the description on the box here. Natural wood and heat-free system. Hand-blown glass nebulizer bottle. Easy-to-use power and output volume control. Built-in timer with auto shutoff. Great for professionals and home users. Simple and elegant design. Use it anywhere in the world. Input voltage from 110 to 240 AC. Courses. Auto shut off, except for that last model, or not last model, but the last uh, timer option that I mentioned previously. The 12 hour option is continuous operation. I don't think it automatically shuts off in that case. Assemble the diffuser and plug it in. Turn the unit on low and add 100% pure essential oil. Replace the cap and adjust the output level. I'm just reading some information on the box. That's probably easier than the owner's manual there. So it looks really nice. I mean, that's pretty... I think you'd put it in that way. The holes on top. I mean, you could do it that way too, maybe. Probably subject to falling that way. Okay. There's a lovely power supply. It's black. Let's plug it in. Let's get this box out of the way. Plug it in right there. Nice, huh? I'm going to plug it into my power strip back here. And I guess I might as well unwrap. And I got. I got those packaged pretty good. Let me get my mic situated here a little better. All right. What did I get? Geranium. And I think the other one was lemon. Probably just pull it out from the top. Nope, it's so snug. I don't even know if I could do that. This is lemon. I think that's going to be my more favorite one right there. There, I got it in focus. How about that? I guess we'll just do what it says. Put it on the low setting. Drip that oil in there. Pretty quiet operation, really. 
This way. And maybe we'll get it zoomed in a little more than that. Make it look pretty. <laughs> so, one of the things about the Aromas brand, uh, as compared to one of the other popular brands, Organic Aromas, is they do not have an LED function. And their claim, I think, is that it's uh, less problematic, less to maintain. And I'll let you decide uh, what you think of that. But I do like the fact that there's timer options when you order it. So, for example, I could have this running all night. Eight hours, anyway. That should be plenty long. Um, I can turn it up. There we go. Now, if I change the... Uh, shutter speed here reduce my eyes so you might be able to see some of the mist focus back on that well actually some light in certain conditions kind of does help so you can see it it looks like i have it camera tilted a little weird i don't know if the black would help some people think no it doesn't really help in this in this particular lighting situation. It definitely works. I mean, you're surely supposed to be operated with this in place. I don't know if you could just do that upside down. Or I don't know if that is upside down or not. The top or the cap. So maybe it really could be that way or this way. Probably either way. This seems to be more visible as mist. All right, well, that's what we have. The Solum Lux Eros refurbished model. I saved 30 bucks by getting the refurbished, so it's $59.99. See, yeah, I don't know, that didn't, it vibrates, so it is subject to maybe tipping, but it didn't like tip off the, the whole thing, but. That creates some nice mist, that's for sure. Well, I better let the video end. Thanks for watching and remember to hit the subscribe button. I don't think you'd necessarily want it on full power all the time, you know. That gives me an idea of what or how loud the pump is supposed to be. Because this is brand new, right? Well, I'll refurbish, but I'm sure they wouldn't sell me a loud pump. So this is pretty standard for the noise. If I can get my mic up there a little closer. There we go. And then I'm going to turn it down. <laughs> nice. Definitely a lot quieter down there. You can hear the air. I'll bump the mic again. I'm having too much fun with this. <laughs> All right, we're going to end the video. Thanks for watching, and I hope you uh, enjoyed watching that, really, to get an idea what this model's like, what it looks like. I think it's pretty cool. All right, peace out, and God bless.